The wind whispers to me tales of distant places, of verdant glades dappled with sunlight. Where is this beauty, this wonder? Why can't I go there? What is this strange being standing before me? The creature speaks. My loneliness falls away like the autumn leaf. The wintry shiver of apprehension sets in. Do I dare ask the many questions I have? Do I dare hear the answers? How? When? Why? Why am I cursed with the burden of thought? I'm a tree, but I think, I feel. How? Other trees have no such faculties, do they? I even have memories. Movement, walking, a cave, but then nothing. There's something about the cave. It's near. Will you search inside for the answers I have lost? Death this prison is, but my bindings cannot be broken like a dead branch. There is no escape, no release. Yes, that tree is me, or rather, it is the life form in which I was the life force. No details do I know. Only that by arcane ritual did Merithrin pervert the natural order. This I never knew, and Merithrin will not recall. He was a revered member of the Mages' Guild in Shornhelm. returned. I did not expect this. Dare I hope, though? Then delay no longer. Any thirst I once felt for life has long since faded. All I seek now is the peace of death.
I... I remember now. I, I remember it all. Oh, God! What a cursed thing did I do! The spell! It trapped me in the tree's form. Being trapped in the tree was a fate worse than any death I can imagine. Though I once did all I could to extend my life, I am now grateful to be granted the peace of death. If you were the one responsible for releasing me, then I thank you.